while back had a request about uh, putting on the uh, you know what, what's involved with the shades that we uh, install and uninstall all the time on our motorhome and I thought I'd give you a little bit of a rundown on it so you could see what it's all about so uh, let's let's start so one thing I find is is that they're really difficult to put on when it's cold when they're cold so when it's it's warm I lay them out in the sun when they're cold I fight with them so today we got a little bit of sun and uh, I thought I'd show you what how we get them on now the way they attach is they attach using these little little cam lock deals here and when I bought the when you buy them they come like this they come with a, a cover and everything that you slip them into but you gotta you gotta put all these snap deals on so it's just a matter of fitting it drilling the holes a little silicone and screwing them in here's the difference so this is what it looks like when you don't have the covers on I mean it's real nice and bright so I'm gonna go out here and install these things real quick it's pretty self-explanatory I do it by myself and uh, but I can't film myself and do it so I'm gonna go ahead and put these things on so you can see what it looks like one thing on a motorhome definitely gonna need a ladder this just happens to fit in my under storage six-foot ladder um, I know there's some that fold up and all that kind of stuff so but this is what I use so here they are going on pretty simple process like I say once they once they've had a chance to be in the Sun they're much easier to put on so this is side one this is the easier one of all of them the two sides all right let me get the big one Okay, once again, here it is, same process on the side, going on, difficult part is getting around these two wiper blades, and look who's in the, in the windshield, alright, let me get it over this, going on, it's over the wipers, like I say, that's the worst part, is getting behind, getting it behind, if you have two people, it makes it easier, by yourself it can be a little bit of a problem but it's there so there it is the front windshield is done it's got these cool little protectors for your wiper blades makes it nice and they also have a uh, extra little pull strap here so you can get that extra oomph them to get that very last snap right there all right so there they are the front's on as you can see it kind of makes it look a little nicer and uh, let me go show you what uh, an advantage to this is now I have them for every window and I'm gonna put those on but that's the hardest one to do right there and you've seen that and there's the little dog in jail so here it is here's what it looks like once you have it on and what's nice about it is, is if you notice the outside, you could not see inside. So it protects, it protects people from being able to see, see you on the inside. Now at night, if you have an, a light on inside, they can kind of see in silhouettes. Mostly what they'll see is the light. But they can't really get a clear vision. They can't actually see you. So one of the advantages is, is it knocks down about 90% of the heat rays and makes it cooler plus I say you can't it, you can't be seen plus they've been I've been told and I kind of believe it because it does seem to keep it a little warmer it's almost like putting a small light windbreaker or something on the outside in the winter time it cuts down on how cold it gets um, we seem to get fogged up windows a lot more without them on when they're on not so much so Here's a regular window. You can see out a regular window. Okay, that's what it looks like. And there's what it looks like when you're looking through those screens. And uh, I just wanted you to see that. I hope that answers uh, the person. I don't, I don't remember who it was at the moment, but I've been meaning to do this for you. 
Um, I hope that answers your questions. I, my, my wife will put the information on where we get them from, and, uh, and you can go from there. there go. All right. As you can see now, they're all on. You know, another thing that's nice about these is, is when it's not hot enough for, for air conditioning, but there's a nice cool breeze, you can open the windows and you still get plenty of air through those. Bugs can't get in. In fact, harder for bugs to get through that than it is regular screens. We have a rear windshield, so we just happen to have one on the back. $1,800 at the windshield. Ask me how I know that. Anyway. There we go, got them on the slide outs. These are snaps. The rest of them have the, the toggle locks, but because the slide out goes in and out, we had to use the snap so it doesn't chew up the thing. But as you can see, and then that's for our hookups for our awning, which my awning is tore pretty bad right there, but I just today got my brand new one and it's black and blue and it's beautiful and I just got to get the time to put it on. And there's KG Boo again. So anyway, a little winded, about 10 minutes to put all these on, oh maybe 10 minutes to uh, put the front one on. The hardest part is, is when you get all done to get them back in the bag, but I've kind of learned a couple of tricks on that, makes it a lot easier. Subscribe. Like us if you love us. If you don't like us, well, just let us know what you think. And also uh, hit the bell so you get, uh, you get notified when we're doing videos. Thanks a lot.